Hello, my name is Alex. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a blade for such sword. Uh, this blade is made out of, I think, 16 polygons and it looks pretty good when uh, we looked at it as a raw model and after we apply a smooth modifier uh, to it, it looks great. So, let's get started. First of all, I'm going to use uh, plane to create the basic height for the blade name it and make it to actable poly choose a suitable color to see the edges more clearly select the upper and the bottom uh, edge and connect them connect 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 one edge, then we are going to select all the vertices and push them together and select the upper ones and push them together a little bit more. Select the upper one and pull it outwards. Then we are going to use border. And go back to edges and deselect the bottom ones, clicking, pressing R on the keyboard and holding Shift and click and drag, and then pull them outwards. Now we can uh, select these parts oh, we are going to align this one pressing S on the keyboard to make a snap tool on and after right clicking on it we should have vertex selected and then we just pull it out upwards and go back to vertices, uh, edges, edge selections and after selecting these edges we are going to set the creased one this means these edges will remain creased after we apply a smooth modifier to it now we are going to make this visible and we are going to deselect these edges and we're going to pull the rest into the space so we get a little bit of the depth for the sword now we are going to leave the edges selected and apply a symmetry modifier to it on the z-axis and then we're going to collapse it and then we are going to realize we have the sword created. Now we can do some modifications because after we apply the norms uh, smooth modifier to it, we can see we have a little bit of two white white taste. So we're going to make it a little bit narrower. And this is pretty much it. We created a blade with crisp edges and the, the top is not fully pointed but if you would like to have it pointed you just need to select these edges and 
set this creased one this way after we reapply norms modifier we get this kind of effect which is pretty cool so this is pretty much it after we create this kind of uh, blade we have the basic knowledge how to create blades for other swords for axes and for other medieval weapons so i hope you learned something new and till next time bye